All right, I'm gonna try this again. This, uh, for some reason, my action keeps turning off. It's getting real irritating. Okay, I'm gonna play Human Empire. I'm gonna play Dark Prophecy 2 campaign. I'm gonna set it up for Mage Lord. Very hard. Let's change the picture. I don't know why I have better luck with this guy. Okay. Okay, this is our first board introduction. Okay, you get to name your leader. Uh, I'm going to name mine after me, except for throwing a little Lord of the Rings flavor there. Hi, Priest, you have arrived at last, my lord. Erhog the Dark and her evil sect control these lands. The few who dared speak against her have disappeared. Her temple is somewhere in the southeast. You must end this madness. All righty. So the other thing I like to do is show the resources. This shows the death mana. I forget what they call the rune mana. And life mana and uh, infernal mana. And that's your gold coins. Okay, the other thing I like to do is turn on the banners so you can see your enemies out here. Let's go in the capital. Okay. There's my uh, mage or archmage. So this is your hero. And he has leadership three. He can use staffs and scrolls. He can use orbs. He can do lightning on six units. So he's like what you would, you want him in the back. These are squires. These are the guys that turn into knights or witch hunters, depending on what you need or what you want to use. Okay, and his leadership is three, so I could take this uh, apprentice with me, which is a 
another lightning guy that does uh, sick targets on six, or I can take this healer, and I want the healer. She can heal. 20 on one unit. Okay, I'm going to go into the paper doll here. We're going to put a healing potion and a healing potion and another one. And these are, these are actually the potions. There's uh, smaller ones that do 50 HP a healing. These actually do 100. And we're going to go out of there. And we're going to take him... And I know, already know this map. I've played this game for like 20 years, so. Alrighty, let's take this guy and this guy. Alrighty, that was cool. Woohoo, four whole points. I gotta go 80. He's gotta go 150. She's gotta go 80. And if you notice, you take a city, it starts growing the grass around it. So if the grass hits that life man, you start collecting that. Okay, let's end that turn. And the Legions of the Dam. Yeah, it. Yeah, probably Drizel. You probably don't pronounce the Y. Okay. And let's get this guy. And you're thief, actually they're thugs, but they're model after a thief, but they uh, they can hit pretty good for this level, and uh, they always get first pick, so we're going to hit him, we're going to hit him, we're going to hit both of them, and we're going to heal this top guy. And we're going to defend, which actually cuts down their damage by about half. And we're going to heal him. And we're going to block like this, block like this, defend. And we'll heal him. In the turn. My lord, the nobles have fled the capital. Urhag and her evil disciples are surely behind this. Be cautious. Well, many nobles have. Alrighty, so. This is the trick now, is if I can take him, let's go here, let's build, let's build a guild, let's back him off of here, let's take, get a thief, Let's go for a duel. Let's 
take another thief. Oh, don't have enough gold. Hmm, okay. So let's go ahead and try. Don't have enough for lightning yet. Let's go ahead and see if we can take it. Uh, uh. So let's block these guys. Okay. See Block. Block. Try it again. Try it again. Let's give him a halo. Let's heal him. Start whacking. Get him out of my face. Oh, man. Okay. Come on, guys. These guys tend to miss a lot on the beginning levels. <laughs> it makes it, it makes it like real, but sometimes it's really irritating. Okay, let's bring our healer, our wizard, back to life, and one archer. I can't do an archer because he will shoot me in the butt. Okay, let's take this girl here. Alrighty. Let's get her out here. Let's go to the capital and research lightning. And I can't build anything until next turn. So 
Sorry about breathing into the mic. All righty, let's take her and, and plant a rod right here. And if an enemy comes, they'd have to unplant that with their staff planter before they could claim that. So that kind of locks it up for a couple of rounds. Yeah, he would have been dead like right now. Oh, well, so let's go block. And let's go here. All righty, let's see. Now this don't work real well. This part of the map is supposed to open up, but it doesn't. Get some rock. Oh, the other one is a blizzard. Dang it. Let's research lightning. I already did. Good. Uh, let's research healing. Now hopefully I can get away with her, but we'll see. She might get whacked because of this guy that's already down here. And I notice on these different ones that they uh they play different. So let's take and get her mm. so I got the spells which is good so I can either heal which I think I'll heal once or I can hit him with lightning like twice. Mm. And I can run. I got basically three options. I could hit him with lightning attack. I could hit him with... Uh, I could hit me with healing and then hit him with one lightning and attack. Or I can just... I think that would help if I run... We'll see. See if he tries to chase me down after doing 30 damage on him. Oh, he's going to come after me. Alrighty. He must have had healing potions. 
So what we want to do is hit him. We want to hit him. We want to run with the wizard. Uh, Okay, so now we want to didn't do haste. Uh Oops, I messed up. I could hit him with lightning twice. So what you could do, because he's going to attack my wizard and he's going to kill him. Oh, he's not. I'm shocked. I really figured he'd jump on him. Because I could hit him twice more with lightning. So I want to take him and keep running so I can get him inside here and get him back alive and healed. That was really surprising. And 12. I just need like seven more of them suckers. Okay. And see, it doesn't really matter that they're gathering the mana, other the frost mana, other than I can use it. But I have the spells, so he don't have them. So that's that's a good thing. Is that my Caesarea? No, no, get his one now. Alrighty, let's get him indoors. And... Oh, I didn't build the temple. Great. Let's go build the temple. And I only got enough gold to bring them to life. So, I'm going to keep running. Okay, I'm going to take her. See if I can run. 
Now this time, let's whip some lightning on her. And let's see what happens. And this guy really came out of nowhere, just come whooping on it. Oh, good. Made him think twice about it. Alrighty. Let's get him into the capital. He'll heal better there anyway. Okay, let's bring this one back to life. And let's trade him out for him for the moment in case oh, we get attacked in there, which I doubt we will. But And I could also use money to heal these guys, but I'm not going to. Let's go here. And I was going to use her to stab, but I'm not going to. I'm going to bring her all the way up here. Uh -huh. What I might do here is, actually, I'm going to end the turn. We'll see what he does. We'll see if he takes this little city down here. Sometimes I'll let the enemies take the cities and then uh, let them pay to upgrade them. Oh yeah, he's going to take the city, which is fine. Okay, the emperor has been poisoned. Corrupt noble sent by Erhog attempted to assassinate him. He survived the attack, but will soon perish if we don't find an antidote. Mm, alrighty. Which means literally that we could probably play the whole game to find an alligator. Okay, I'm on about half an hour, so I'm going to pause this and continue in the next one.